Hey, what's up everyone? So welcome back to another video and today I'm gonna show you another build for the Windows 10 Mobile. It's been a while actually since I did a review on the builds because these new builds that are coming out, they don't bring new features. So they bring only bug fixes, which the bug fixes, they are not really so much important they are like for Cortana, for keyboard, for languages. The build is with the number 14965 uh, and this build just like the of the previous one, I, I skipped the previous one, I wanted to skip this one as well, but then I said like, okay, let me make a video. Uh, this build works pretty fast and the bug for the TubeCast still it's not fixed. I'm pretty sure this will not even got, get fixed because it, I kind of have to restart, reset the phone and then it will work. It might be a problem from the app itself and not from the and not from the OS because this app kind of crashed like from day to night and I tried to uninstall it, install it, so everything didn't work and the clock still, as you can see, have to turn the screen off, turn on and then the clock should work, <laughs> yeah, the clock works then. Um, but then this build um, like brings fixes for uh, Microsoft Edge as well, Microsoft Edge feels pretty smooth now, um, the, like I tried every website to, to go in and Every, every website opens, there's no website that it crashes or something like that. Maybe in v websites with videos, it might give some lags there, but other than that, the websites work pretty fast. And now on the insider's preview on the fast ring that we are, uh, Microsoft released an update for the weather. Now you can have um, transparent weather on the like transparent like tiles. Um, as you can see here, now it's now it's normal, but you saw there previously was transparent. Now it's normal, like previously. Let's go here back. Let's go into settings. And as you can see here, there is an option transparent live tiles. Turn it on. Let's close the app and it will take actually some time until it, it will get updated. Oh, actually it was pretty fast. You see here, let's try to focus. You see here, the background doesn't really help much. See here, the background doesn't really help much, but uh, now we have transparent live tiles, uh, which I like it because it's transparent and many people were asking for transparent live tile. But then on the background, you don't really have that like, not image, but that like um, slideshow where when it's raining, it was showing like a slideshow. When it's uh, like, uh, like now, for example, it's cloudy, there it, it shows these clouds on the live tile, which this uh, transparent live tile doesn't really show. So I kind of like to, to, to have this background of the clouds and stuff like that. And I also don't mind because as you, as you see, I put until this part, I put the transparent live tiles. And then on this part, I put every tile that don't have transparency. So I don't really mind it to have this one, but many people were asking for transparency and that's pretty nice. And I hope Microsoft brings this kind of settings for like every kind of apps because, um, for example, the notification center, let, let, let be there an option to have transparent notification center or to have it just black like this. Or for example, in the Windows Store, let's have an, an option as well in the Windows Store to have, for example, when you go like this, to have this um, menu to have transparent let let me have here an option in the settings for example to have transparency in the store or to choose between la uh, between white theme and dark theme because we as users we want more and more options and we kind of know that windows phone now it doesn't really in the it's not in the best stage right now but I mean, we kind of have to ask for these options to for Microsoft to 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 make them. Uh, but overall, the OS runs fine. I mean, Facebook still crashes after some time. Actually, I, I use Facebook better. Or actually, I was want to say you guys um, go and use Facebook better from the store because Facebook better, at least at this moment, it works much better and it and it's more stable than the official Facebook. Official Facebook, I use it for like maybe maximum one minute and then it crashes. Facebook beta, I can use it for 5-10 minutes and then it might crash. But Facebook beta, it works better than Facebook normal. And yeah, this build doesn't, doesn't, doesn't really bring any features. 
I just wanted to let you know that this build works fine, um, it doesn't bring like uh, worst bugs, uh, and the better, the best feature is the transparent weather, which many people are asking, and when people ask, why just don't give them? But yeah, thank you guys for watching, and see you in the next one.